Hey guys, Silent Zero here. Welcome back to another video of Kingdom Hearts Unchained Key for the English server. So, we are on the last run for the challenge event. Uh, so, let's get down to it and uh, use 11 or more special attacks. Uh, complete without having to continue and equip the treasure trove keyblade. Uh, shouldn't be that difficult considering that the uh, stage is filled with. Uh, only <laughs> six or more heartless so um, 11 or more oh boy um, I guess this is the point where you really need to uh, sparingly use your medals uh, so spread out the amount of uh, single hit um, medals and yeah, if you need to, just use the opposite um, to their weakness, and yeah. So I've got two down, three. I'm gonna smack, smack. Okay, so four. Uh, so I guess I was quite in a bad position for those uh, heartless. If used four, I need another seven more. So I got one, two, three, four. Five, six. I should be able to do it, but I won't have the first turn kill. And seven. So I didn't complete the last challenge, uh, which is equip the treasure trove keyblade. So that won't be a problem. All you do is just redo with the treasure trove keyblade, and yeah, you're good to go for that stage. And let's move on to the second round. Uh, open all treasure chests, complete without having to continue. And so it's not a difficult stage, uh, just have to be careful with uh, the level 150 pretenders. Um, yeah, uh, shouldn't be that difficult if even for a free to play player. Uh, just need to bring in the correct medals. So at this point of time, you probably need uh, all the single target uh, magic medals. So for me, yeah, I'm pretty set already. So I'm gonna open all the chest. Make sure you check around every single nook and cranny. Oh boy. So, I've been doing the Red Boss event and um, yeah, my 3 wishes Keyblade is kind of low on the gauge. So, yeah, uh, mm, should have gone to recharge the gauge first before entering the event. Maybe I should have just used uh, my Sora and Pelt for the finishing blow instead. Oh boy. So 
So just checking around to see everything is open. And yeah. Let's go. Hmm. All right, there we go. So I noticed the um I I I noticed how unpopular the videos for the US server have become. Uh I do need to let you guys know I'll probably cut back on making videos on the US server unless the events are really um unique. Um because apparently uh the the series for this challenge event has really gotten very poor views on my videos and I think I, I, I shan't waste time recording videos that people don't want to watch so this would probably be the last time I record an event for the US server uh, unless the event is rather unique in a way that requires some thinking um, this event does require some thinking at certain points of stages uh, but still not to the certain uh, level of uh, seeking help online so i don't think i will do another video for the us server anytime soon uh, unless they are pools uh, i'm sh everyone loves to watch pools videos uh, for any server uh, especially yeah if you want to um, see what other people get uh, especially if you want to know the the pool rate percentage uh, for a particular epic metal carnival so yeah um, I, I do have to apologize if there is a lack of content for the US server but it seems that people aren't really interested in watching videos for the US side since everything is in English you know Mm, so all right, let's get down to the third round and objectives is to equip medals of three star or less uh, Okay, Lady Lucky Blade, so we probably have to go in to do some adjusting So I'm gonna use the second round I'm gonna have to unequip everything first and let's get down to Filtering so three stars. Oh boy. <laughs> so I've got nothing on my oh my goodness the three stars I'm lacking so um <laughs> I'm just gonna slot in whatever I have and I'm gonna just go with whatever medals I have currently on hand and find a friend medal that will support me all the way to the end of the quest um yeah it might be a bit ridiculous but that's the whole idea for that particular stage you just need to have medals of three style less available in your entire keyblade setup so yeah let's get down to this uh, hopefully we are able to clear it i'm just gonna bring in my friends sephiroth uh in case i do need an aoe <laughs> but if i recall mm, the stage doesn't need aoe yeah so i guess it's my bad on the oh, this is just ridiculous <laughs> Alright, so pretty lucky there, I guess. Uh, okay, so I do need some sort of AoE. At yeah. Alright, checking again. So I can open chest. Uh, not, forget not forgetting there are some objectives where you aren't allowed to open any of the treasure chests. Uh, okay, 
So, nah, I'm not gonna activate any of their skills. It's a bit meaningless except Sephiroth. Alright, so hopefully my defense can hold out. Alright, yep. So I get to live another day and complete the thing. There we go, so the stage complete. Uh, I should be able to clear all the objectives. Should be. There we go. So it's not necessary to have an entire key blade filled with three star medals. All you have to do is just um, you know, use whatever you have, uh, as you can see. Alright, round four. Um, completed without being afflicted. And. Treasure Trove Keyblade, so not too difficult, just need to avoid all the heartlesses. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna bring this uh, key, this Keyblade, oh no, no, I should bring in the Treasure Trove. Yeah, so I don't want to redo this stage again, save a bit of time. I do need to get back to the Raid Boss event, uh, currently on level 7 and just 3 more away to get the Chip and Dale medals, I guess. Whoa, oh boy, oh boy, hold on, I, I, I need to time myself here, don't want to end up touching any of them. So yeah, um, that was pretty simple. <laughs> There we go. So not as difficult as another uh, one of the previous events on the US server where you had to go through a maze of heartlesses that were above 250 or is it 220? I'm not too sure. So that was a bit more crazy than this one. Uh, so thanks, thank, I have to thank the US server's leniency, I guess. So it's a bit easier for people who um are free to play yeah all right so round five eighty thousand or more damage with one hit oh my goodness and i thought they would lighten up all right so uh, i know i didn't record the video of me doing the previous days uh Let's see, how much damage was it? 40,000. Um, I managed to go, I managed to get a 50,000 damage hit. Uh, but I don't know if I'm able to master up 80,000. <sighs> Alright, so I'm just gonna try. I'm just gonna try, hopefully, hopefully I do get uh, an 80,000. Alright, so which keyblade was it that I used? Alright, so it was Olympia. Uh, I need a Gilded Medal. Alright, so I do have a Malusia. Uh, attack Boost 2, so I guess I should be able to do it. Yikes! Uh, yeah, luckily I have my white rabbits and my Arif. Alright, let's do this shit. I'm praying so hard that I actually am able to complete this. Oh no. Alright, so crossing my fingers and let's do this! Ten thousand damage! Holy! Mm. 
Okay, so I got to thank who's, whoever that player was for having a fully guilted Malusia. That was insane. Uh, especially for me, who's a free-to-play player, that is a heck of a load of help. Uh, I have to thank those people who have paid to play. Uh, you guys are the best. I mean, thank you for boosting the society up. Uh, and... Thank you for the RNG of appearing <laughs> onto my friend list of medals. Oh boy. Alright, so that's about it for this challenge event. Uh, it's It's been fun with you guys, uh, who, whoever has watched my videos. I thank you guys for sticking around with me for the on the US videos. Uh, and yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed my videos. For the US side as well as the Japanese ones. Uh, yeah, so I hope to see you guys in the next videos that I'll make. And until then, bye!